What's up, this is Jake with Hike734, climbing with Mark, Ashley, Tiffany, and Kristen to going to the Sun Mountain in its magnificent summit in Glacier National Park. We started out at Sai Bend and worked our way up the Pegan Pass Trail and peeled off and went right up in between Matapi and going to the sun to the summit. And uh, yeah, just traveling through the beautiful Sai Creek in the morning and then working our way up through the trees. And uh, we kind of passed the uh, turn off the first go around, um, the little climber's trail that heads up there. And um, But once we found it, it was nice. Nice way to work our way up and just, I keep saying this and I hope it doesn't get too old, but the bear grass is ridiculous this year and it was just super gorgeous and uh, it was kind of fun to be hiking up going to the Sun Mountain with the sun back in the background. Um, but we started working our way through the uh, lower stretches below a cliff band and of course as always the higher you go the views get better and this definitely did not disappoint at all looking up kind of towards the Logan Pass area. As we were going through the cliffy section, we ended up seeing this guy. There's a nice grizzly bear hanging out at the tops of the cliffs, so it, we definitely kept an eye on him as it, as it moved up. And so it adjusted our route a little bit as we went up through uh, the big old scree section on our way up to the saddle. And uh, yeah, it was uh, cool to see it as we worked our way up through the scree section and uh, went up finally to the saddle. It has the amazing views looking down onto Sexton Glacier. And um, the saddle is between Matapi and going to the sun. And so then from there, we normally would just kind of follow that ridge line up, but because of the bear digging around in the rocks looking for bugs, we stayed low and traversed across. And uh, there's a goalie route, which I really wanted to do because I love that route, but that had too much snow in it. So we just went up through the cliffs and then worked our way just kind of up through more scree, which was kind of the theme of the day. And finally we got up towards the top and the top has amazing views. It looks just from the Logan Pass area looking south all the way west and then north and it's just for days and days and days. And after spending a little bit of time up on the summit, the clouds were gathering and we knew there were thunderstorms in the forecast today so we uh, wanted to make sure that we didn't get struck by lightning and thunderstorms can be kind of sketch in this particular summit. So we turned around and headed on down, back down through the scree, back down through the cliffs, stopped for a second for a little, another snack, then, then back down through the bear grass because it's beautiful. And uh, anyways, now we're just cruising on through the trail here. Lots of flowers this time of year. And uh, it was definitely super fun to see the grizzly, obviously a little bit unnerving too, but it was nice just watching him across a big vast scree slope. So anyways, going to the Sun Mountain. Going to the Sun Road gets its name from this mountain, by the way, you should check it out. Anyways, this is Jake with Hike 734, hiking with Mark, Ashley, Tiffany, and Kristen to the top of going to the Sun Mountain and Glacier National Park. If you like this video, make sure you subscribe on YouTube and head on over to hike734.com for more goodness.